Hi everybody, Catfish Jones here. Today is the 22nd of April 2020. This is the CFJ Vlog. A little bit of an almanac about my history playing guitar over these past several years. Original songs, how they've grown, how they've changed, and how they've begun, including a Fresh Fish release, although I think the official video came out the other day. First time playing this song on the vlog. It's called Don't Be. It goes like this. Was a time when we were young, never thought that life would change, and now it seems we will never be the same. A new song called Don't Be, it's a hard one for me, not just because I'm you know, up here playing power chords the whole time, but as a player, I don't usually do the solid downstroke chug -a very much. Usually my strum pattern's like a... Something like that, with a little bit of shuffle in there, and only down once or twice. This is just straight down. like three and a half minutes and by the end of it this little muscle right here is like oh my gosh so mad props to all of you chug-a-luggers out there who can play some stuff this song came um did a deep dive into the ramones one day which i've always been a big fan of the ramones but i uh, watched kind of a career resume of, of the whole group and uh you know from album to album to album to album 
and really saw the connections between like the Ramon style 70s punk and you know even early 80s and and you know later 80s really tying that into like the 60s surf rock and even the girl pop of that era so similar in their songwriting styles although the, <laughs> the delivery is very different um in fact when i was playing that song i was you know really playing it up trying to sing the ramones bit and for me i thought the lyrics came out a lot more like a misfit song or something like that but i really wanted this uh this i don't know driving tempo thought it was very important and then of course when i did the video i couldn't help but lean all the way into 80s synth which I'm, I'm enjoying as well in a completely different vein. Um, some of my recent tiny painting music has shown uh, tendencies towards the synth wave as well as plenty other things, but that's one that, uh, you know, it just was, it was an easy song to write. It, it, it almost happened entirely in my head and while I was at work. By the time I got home, all I had to do was just transcribe it from the noggin down onto some type of recording device piece of paper, notepad, computer file, audio file, who knows? But I have it here, got to share it with you, and look forward to being able to share more songs here from the stoop. It's a very wet and rainy Wednesday here, but I think we're going to survive. As for me, I've got more work to do. i got to head back and uh, do all that stuff, so uh, all of you folks enjoy your time, and we will see you very soon. Cheers.